Slick Talk God, Slick Walk Nation. Gnome. Gnome. I just finished watching Loaded Lux versus Rum Nitty. All right. Like, just finished watching it. And this is when I like to do these blogs when I just finished watching it. Let me say this first before we even get into that. This gnome turned out to be a great card. Very entertaining card, right? Now, if you heard me before, I said, you know, the the battles is not, you know, it's, it's a decent card. And I also said, sometimes you put battles together that you look at like, and these two don't even go together and they be crazy. This card turned out to be a very entertaining and dope card, man. Oh, man. I started watching it driving, doing all that, so I couldn't really get into it. I saw some of the battles. I missed Danny Myers and um, who Danny battled? All right, you know he battled. But I, I, I missed the beginning battle. I'm going to go watch all these battles again, so it, it doesn't matter. <clears throat> but the first battle I watched over was Lux versus Rumnitty. <sighs> Did we get pop lux? Because I should I should have titled this. I just watched pop lux versus rum nitty. That's the lux we wanted to see. Period. That's the lux we wanted to see. That's the exact nitty we wanted to see. Well, I wanted to see. If you look at my blog before, as I said, nitty got a thing where. On a big stage, he doesn't rap like he normally raps. I mean, he'd be stopping and waiting for the crowd to catch the ball. That's not Nitty style. Nitty style is constantly punching and rapping with a flow. That's when Nitty is unstoppable. That's exactly what he did in this battle. He did Nitty and was on top tier level. So now we do this. For anybody that watched this battle, if you say this battle wasn't hard to judge, I don't agree with you. I don't agree with you. Before I did this blog, I saw people putting a lot of people putting up two one lux. Um, I saw I saw people putting up nitty. I saw a little more two one lux. I'm gonna go. I put I put an asked on Twitter. Who y'all got winning the battle? I for my Twitter, it was a lot of two one lux. Right. Me watching this battle from the first round. All right, and going to the first round, Lux goes. Lux first round was fired to me from start to finish. Nitty goes. Nitty first round is fire. And I feel like Nitty rapped a little longer than Lux, right? That made me edge Nitty the first round because he rapped a little longer, but it wasn't no dead spots where it died down. He rapped and got busy for the whole length of him rapping, right? Now, I told y'all before how I judge battles, too, is round by round, but I also judge them on all three rounds together uh, based on consistency. So Lux was fire in the first round. Nitty was fire. They was equally fire to me. Nitty just rapped a little longer and was fire a little longer. I edged into that round. <clears throat> Second round. Lux starts, and <clears throat> in the beginning, I'm like, damn, where, where is Lux going? Like, in the very beginning, he kind of was losing me in the very, very beginning. And I'm like, and I'm, I'm looking at the crowd, and I'm like, you know, it looked like it's, it's not going, it's not at where he was in the, in the first round. The minute I thought that, he took off. And when I say he took off, how he said God had, he, that's where he went. He went to God level on him. He was up there. I saw him talking to God. He had the God head. I don't know what that means, but I guess he was cutting God hair, son. He was doing something, but he was up there. All right? Way up there. Wait, he, as soon as I thought that he took off, he was gone. And he just was up there. Wilding. Luck second round is a masterpiece. A masterpiece crazy nitty go nitty is also fire in the second round 
for the people that's that's saying Lux two one right, and they and I see a lot of people saying second and third. I want y'all to explain to me why y'all got Lux in the second round, right? I, I want y'all to explain to me why do y'all have Lux in the second round? Nitty second round was also fire. So now let's skip to the third and come back to the second. Third round. Lux goes. He's still up there. He's still up there. Nitty goes. And he's right there. Fire. All three rounds from both of them is fire. Nitty third round is short or shorter than Lux third round. So it clearly looks like Lux won that round. Right? Just off when you watch it, Lux going off. Nitty was going off too, but it, it, it fell short. It just kind of, you're waiting for more and it just stopped. Lux got the third round, period. So it's really, for me, Nitty edged the first round. He got the first. Lux got the third. It really comes down to this second round. And this is why I said, for the people that got Lux second and third, I can understand why you got in the second. I mean, the third. I want to know why you have from the second what is your reason now i'm gonna give you my reasoning on who i got in the second and why to me both of them was equally fire in the second round the second round was hard as i'm watching the second round i'm like i don't i don't understand how people can really this round is close. It, both of them is going off. I don't. I, I don't understand how people can pick like. Because like I said, Lux went through the roof, but then Nitty came after and kept that same energy. This is what made me pick a winner. In the second round, and this is what made it easy for me. I watched the second round. I went back and watched the second round again. Two times I watched the second round. And when we're talking about battle rap, all right, if you're talking about a cypher, anybody could get up there in a cypher and just rap. That's that's the point of a cypher. Just go off. When you sit in front of a camera, it's people, you're just going off. The science of battle rap is to attack your opponent. That's what it is. If you look at if battle rap had directions and you read the directions, it would say attack your opponent thoroughly. When you watch the second round, Nitty had a bunch of fire lines that could have went to anybody. Crazy fire. But it wasn't solely wrote for Lux, like it was tailor made for Lux. Lux second round was way more direct and tailor made for Rum Nitty, in my opinion. After me watching it twice, I didn't want to get up here and say that, and it wasn't. That's why I watched it again, and that's how I really feel. Lux second round, the fact that he went up there, both of them went crazy. But the fact that Lux went up there and it was tailored made for Nitty, the stuff he was saying in that round, he couldn't say to nobody else. Tailor made for Nitty. That's why I gave Lux the second round. And that was the only reason I could find. That was my reasoning on it. So I gave Nitty the first. Even though that, that one was hard to call. So I gave me the first because of him going a little longer. And it made it feel like he won that round because of the, the, the longer he went, the slight longer he went. And he was still cooking. I gave Lux the third. Because he was cooking. Had a full, felt like a full length, good, healthy round. 
Nitty came on and was cooking, but he it's like at the end he fell short and I was waiting for more. It was like, wait, that's it? So Lux clearly got that third round. Second round, like I said, it came down to who was more direct for me. And it was Lux. Lux was, he crafted his round for Rum Nitty. Nitty had a bunch of crazy bars, like I said, but a lot of the stuff he was saying could go towards anybody. And if we, if if I'm going, if I got to find a, a winner and I have to pick something and I'm, I'm saying in my head, all right, so battle rap is a sport and the main objective is to attack your opponent. Who did that more? Lux definitely did that more in the second round. And this is why I gave Lux the second round. All right. Now, known for, known for, was it known 14? I said known for, I don't know. I think it's known 14. Overall, was a dope event. I'm going to break down all of the battles. I wanted to do this one by itself, though. I'm also going to do a, um, a live because I want y'all to come in and I want to feed off what y'all saying about this battle. All right. So I want to do, I want to, I want to break down all the battles and a live also. I'm going to break them down first. So the next blog I put out, I'm going to break down all the battles on, on that blog. And then I'm going to do a live. So let's say we do a live. Um, Let's say Monday. Let's say tomorrow. Let's say Monday we do a live. You know what I'm saying? Y'all hit me on my uh my Twitter, my Instagram. Tell me a time y'all think I should go live. And let's let's do a live Monday. Let's get on here and discuss the whole card. And I really want to know what y'all feel. All right. Slick Talk God, Slick Walk Nation. I'm going. <laughs>